Hey everyone, I'm Jared and I turned 21. My birthday was December 17th and I'm just going to get the normal stuff out of the way. There was a party. Uh, I hung out with my brothers and a couple of their friends and we just kind of went to a brewery and a bar and they own a distillery so of course we had to hang out there. And uh, I got drunk, almost passed out on the floor. I took my shoes off. Uh, towards the very end of the night my memory was getting hazy and I just kind of went there and my one of my other brother's voice in my head was telling me if you take your shoes off they ain't gonna mess with you so i took my shoes off like a professional and laid down and then they're like all right let's go so uh yeah i did puke both during the thing and uh afterwards with a hangover never want to get a hangover again um we did pallet jack racing don't do that i broke my glasses um we played cards played pool all that so that was fun uh, there, there was another bit to it, though, that was interesting, which is I'm entering, you know, I expect to live 100 years, so I'm entering the, uh, my 20, like my 20 solid, like I'm done with 20 years, let's enter the next 20, you know, and, you know, I'm entering, if I finished off, you know, uh, years 11 through 20, you know, a set of 10 years. I'm starting another set of 10 years, and I don't know, I'm excited. I'm excited because the towards the end of this year, um, it was really good. I, I knew ever since I was 16 that I would look back at every year and be like, wow, I was dumb. I learned so much. I was so cringy, and uh, that is the case here, um, you know. My birthday was one of the first things me and my girlfriend, before we were boyfriend-girlfriend, uh, celebrated. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm ready. I, every year, probably since I was 19, not every year, every, like, month, the more and more I learn, the more and more I realize I don't know. And it's been interesting. I don't know a lot, and or at least what I think I do. Like, even a month ago, I learned so much about myself and freelancing that I didn't know. I learned about, you know, different things about making money, relationship dynamics, all that stuff. I, I didn't know about, and I learned. So, I'm excited. Uh, 21 really doesn't matter to me. Alcohol and weed, that's about the only cool thing since I'm 21. Uh, and cigarettes at some places, but uh, no. So, I don't know what I'm going to end up doing this year. I'm excited to do new things. This 2020, I'm going out of the country for the first time with my girlfriend. We're going to Korea and Japan. And then Los Angeles, which sometimes feels like... California sometimes feels like out of the country because it's a different state. But, hey, it's an experience, and... I'm going to try really, really hard to make it so when I turn 22, I'm not working at Walmart because I hate it. I love the people I work with. They're really nice people. But God damn, this job sucks. Like, it doesn't suck as bad as, like, if I was in the military or a server at Applebee's. But I hate it. I don't want to be here anymore. I didn't want to be here since day one, and, you know, this this year's had a lot of challenges for me. Um, this is the first time I'm going to say this, because at this point it's okay to say, my parents, the reason why I moved out was my parents divorced, and I was living with them. And so the day after they divorced, I was like, well, fuck it, I'm just going to go to Walmart and see if they'll hire me, and they did, they did like, the day after... They separate. I moved in with my girlfriend that day, and I got a job at Walmart, and I don't want to have this job anymore. And them separating has driven me to work extra hard and really try to make uh, make myself a better person and work, work, work really hard and smart, you know, on everything. Not just work, but relationships and all that. And it's been, it's been an experience, and... I, I don't know, I, it's crazy, crazy what that did for me. Um, 
I also stopped training in martial arts. I executed on that terribly. I hurt a lot of feelings that I didn't mean to hurt. And, you know, I've been training there for 12 years, and I just decided, and I decided for some personal reasons that I did not want to train there anymore. And also this year, um, I got my girlfriend. You know, we, we became boyfriend and girlfriend. I mean, that's exciting. I'm really happy about that. So uh, this year's probably held the best of times and the worst of times. But at the end of it, now that I'm 21, I have a little bit clearer vision of kind of what I want to do with my life. I still have no idea yet also an idea, and I'm okay with that. Um, I'm more comfortable with... I'm more confident, more comfortable doing my own thing, you know. And I'm more comfortable talking to people, like when it comes to interpersonal relations. I think I'm more comfortable with that. I still... There's a lot about interpersonal relations that I don't like, but I'm getting getting there. So, uh, I'm 21. I can do drunk live streams now, or, you know, I'm excited to do that, actually. Um, I'm going to work really hard at freelance. Expect this year for me to not produce a lot of content. Working at Walmart. Working freelance. You can see the bags in my eyes. I have a lot of... Uh, four hour sleep nights, six hour sleep nights. But I'm gonna work really hard. I'm already at about four hundred dollars a month. Walmart pays me twelve. Okay. Four hundred dollars. Walmart pays me twelve. I can taste it. I've already removed some hours from Walmart. This is it. This is the hustle. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make it work. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do at 22. At 20, When I turn 22, I'm going to try to not be working at Walmart. And if I do, still, it's it's fine. You know, I still, early in the process, I'm uh, just going to do my thing. My glasses are dirty as fuck. So, yeah, uh, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. And uh, this has been another vlog about my life. And I'm 21. Should have uploaded this a couple days ago. I'm filming it now. I'll see you guys in the next year, and let's hope I ain't working at Walmart no more. All right. See you guys later.